Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Plant vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, to celebrate the 100th episode of the series, we are spending 3,140,866 coins at the Mr. Rewardatron 9000. I'm super excited for this, we've been working with this or for this for the last 40 episodes. Our last spending spree was episode 60, the one before that was episode 20, so this is our third spending spree and three million coins to go along with it. I wanna give you guys a big thank you for supporting the series thus far. It has been one of my most successful and most popular yet, and I really appreciate it. Of course, I love playing this game. I'll be playing plenty more of it, and the more you guys support of it, the more I'll try to make. So yeah, Mr. Reward of Tron, Reward O Tron 9000. I'm not gonna dilly-dally too much. We have, I mean, what? A hundred capsules we can spend here? So that's pretty cool. Starting with the temperature lips, part of the Dr. Nurse set for the Rare Scientist. Number one hope for today's episode is to get the Zebra Chomper costume. Whoa, Corn Brotherhood costume, that's cool. Of course, these are all things we'll be showcasing in the future, all costumes, hats, item sets, and dirt. It's an emote, awesome. <laughs> But yeah, we'll continue just to sort of check things out and hope for the best. This time we get the stretch and stuff gesture. I like that one. That's for the Colonel Corn. And we're just gonna be doing this for all of today's episode. Check out what other cool stuff we have. The groovy shoe, part of the groovy smooth set for the 80s action hero. And down this way, we also get the smi smiley tail, part of the jovial gesture set, okay. And there's a lot of sets I haven't gotten. I'm guessing a lot of the stuff will be set pieces, but okay, I thought that was golden. That's green, not too shabby expression. Uh, yeah, it might take a little bit to get through some of the stuff to get to the good things, but that's okay. We get the glam scarf, part of the glam cap set. And of course, I'm recording this right before Feast of It starts. That'll be beginning next episode. We got a super rare. Whoa, the fairy queen for the rose. That looks beautiful. That might be one of my favorite costumes yet. Yeah, that looks really pretty. And a rare. It is the Mastermind Beard for the Hair Flare Mastermind set for the Super Brains. Pretty cool. And another rare, the Conquering Cobbs Corn Conqueror set for the Colonel Corn. Lots of set pieces, which is fine. Got another rare. It is the Itchy Scratchy Jest for the Snapdragon. He's so cute, just scratching his little itches. Another or back-to-back -back rares right now. Soggy Overboard, part of the Overboard set for the Captain Deadbeard. That's awesome. A lot of these sets I've not seen before too, so that's pretty good that we're starting some new stuff. Merrymaker Collar, part of the Merrymaker set. Like, I don't think I've ever heard of that, so very interesting. Next up, whoa, here we go, our first legendary. It is the Sunsea Squiddy re Reaction Hat. Legendary hat there for the Nightcap. Our first nightcap legendary hat, very exciting. And hopefully that's only one of many. We get the Kendo Cage, part of the Kendo Doom Jaw set for All Star. And I'm hoping, I'm also hoping for some Space Cadets things today, because I don't really have anything for Space Cadet. We get the Bitey Bow for the Bitey Bride set for Chomper. I don't have any completed sets. I don't think I have any costumes for Space Cadet. So if that changes today, that'd be great. We get Spider Gate, a victory slab. And we're not even our first million coins, and we're not even our first half a million coins in. We're just sort of getting there right now. Yuck. <laughs> Another expression. So we'll be able to get lots of progress done in collecting everything. We get the end expression. <laughs> lots of expressions, I'm sure, as we get through. We seem to be getting less common, or less or more uncommon things. Uh, sunny is a gesture for sunflower. And stay tuned to the end if you want a deeper look at everything we're unlocking here. Uh, we get the Olive Chomper, that's a common costume, that's a recolor. But uh, yeah, we'll be taking a look at everything we've unlocked at the end of today's episode, so stay tuned for that, a deeper look at it. The Sushi Shrine Victory Slab. And if you want an even more in-depth look, then stay tuned to the upcoming episodes, there'll be many more. This is heavy. And, boom. Precious Lay, oh okay, it's like a little, like a necklace for the pea shooter. Oh, another rare. Crystals of power for the Crystal Crusader set for the nightcap. We do have the uh, the one like neck piece for that. So that's at least two pieces into that set. The Destination Rockets, Destination Punk set, Electric Slide. That one seems cool. And the Bomb Squad hat, it's like pants for head. So this is just a super rare hat for the soldier. Very interesting, not part of a set, not a reaction hat 
Ooh, another super rare Chocotron. He's a chocolate Citron, as delicious as he is vicious. Super cool. I like that one. And Mr. Bikes Flapper, part of the Mr. Bike set. Oh, that's cool. Having a bike themed one is really cool of the All Stars. Uh, Beach Nut Barnacle is part of the Beach Nut set for the Acorn. Cool to see some cost customizations for uh, for Oak. You don't see too many. For Neighborville! Oh, I like that one. That one's cool. And... Colonel Step Jester celebrate by shaking your body in a specific way. That's our second Colonel Corn Jester today, so that's awesome. Along with it... Golf View, part of the Golf Gully set for the All-Star. Lots of All-Star stuff right now, which is great. Whoa, another legendary! It is gonna be the Crow's Nest reaction hat for the Captain Deadbeard. I think our first ever Captain Deadbeard legendary hat. Very cool to see it. Then a uh, common, fingers crossed. Can't really relate to that one. But another common, the Hammer Nation Punchers. Hmm, okay, two hammers. And a rare. Next time, we're getting a lot of the more basic things. Expressions, punchers, victory slots. We haven't been getting these too many in spending sprees. Tippity tappity for the uh, for the Citron. That's a jester. And we're under two million now. So we still, that was our first like 1.1 million. G P Egyptology coils. Oh cool, I like the P Egyptology set. Very hard to pronounce, but very cool to look at. Fung Fu Gesture, lots of cool gestures so far. Can't wait to take a deeper look at those. And a common. Oh, it is a Sublime Lime set. I like that one. I like the recolor. So they can sort of be like a little bit of extra spice. Groove Moves Gesture. <laughs> she looks so happy in that. She loves to dance. And Taunt Stretch Gesture for the Pea Shooter. Back to back gestures right now, pretty cool. And Astro Shoulders, part of the Astro Imp set. Ooh, can't wait to check that out once that's completed. That looks like it could be cool. Rainbow Bling Glasses, part of our Lashes Rainbow Bling set for the 80s action hero. And we're about to reach like halfway through. So it shows you we have twice as much action. Jacko Cobb Spectrum Hat, that looks cool. That looks like it could have been a nice addition to Lawn of Doom. And Magnetic Mouth Clamp. Part of, part of the Magnetic Magnificent set for the scientist. A huge variety of items so far. Space Racer, yes! A costume for the Space Cadet Space Racer. That looked really cool. I like that one. Next up, Hair Flare Mastermind, part of the Hair Flare Mastermind set. I love that one. We already got the mustache for it, so we're getting closer to completing that one. But there's a rare waiting for us. It is out of this world. An expression. And a common, could be a common costume, it is the Jukebox Joyride Victory Slab. What about this one? Oh, a super rare Bookworm Spectrum Hat. That is a very, very uh, plump bookworm. Must have a uh, lot of words to, to, to digest. The Space Chopper Helm, part of the Space Chopper set. I'm so glad we're getting Space Cadet stuff. She's a really cool class, I don't play her as much as I should. And a legendary, our third one, the Bug Beats Reaction Hat. Oh man, three legendary hats so far, that is one for the Imp. I think that might be our second Imp legendary hat. And we get the Mighty Cast, part of the Mighty Mistake set for the 80s action hero. We're getting there, we're more than halfway through everything. I have not seen the Zebra Chomper. Overboard Water Wing, part of the Overboard set. Very cool. And another rare, Collectorific. That's what I'm trying to do right now, is Collectorific everything. It doesn't really sound like I'm using the word correctly, but anyways, Feathered Arrow Cap. That's just a common hat for the acorn. Looked pretty cool though. And a rare. Shielded Shoulders, part of the Fuzzy Fanatic set. Hmm. Another rare. Glam Cap Hairdo, part of the Glam Cap set. That's actually the, yeah, that's what this nightcap over here has. Interesting. I like that. So we have 1.3 million coins left to spend. This is, oh nice, the Azure P. Very cool, he's nice and blue, which is what Azure means. Oh, a super rare Disco Destruction Spectrum Hat. Lots of cool Spectrum Hats today, but not yet the Z Chomper. 
Come on. Pretty Kitty Bow, part of the Pretty Kitty set. Oh, fancy. I don't know if we've seen that one yet. What about this one? It is the Aviator Tailfin, part of the Pop Top Aviator set. Cool. And in this one, Patch of Progress, part of the Leaf Cadet set for the Sunflower. It's like a, a uh, eye patch. Another rare, Arms of Valor, the Leaf Cadet set again. Is that what she has over here? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it definitely is. So soon enough, we might be able to dress up as a Major Sweetie. That'd be cool, I would, I would like that. Oh no, I'm saying that word again, cool, over and over again. I'm sorry, I just, I get so excited. Everything in this game is awesome. Common, soup. Soup is pretty good. Tastes delicious, depending on the soup, I guess. Got another common. Oh, the blush cactus. If she felt embarrassed, you'd never know it. I love that one. Glad to be getting all of the recolors out of the way. A super rare fortune cap spectrum hat. Nice. For the rose that time. We haven't gotten too many rose things. We got that one rose costume earlier. The doctor nurse cap, part of the doctor nurse set for the scientist. I like that one. And what about this one? Cyber Visor, part of the Citrus Cyber set. I don't think I've seen that one. We are now under one million coins, so we're two thirds of the way through everything, and we get a common Beef Wellington. That's a popular one. A lot of people use Beef Wellington. I like it. And it's a rare coming in. Bitey Cake, part of the Bitey Bride set. <laughs> oh yeah, we got the bow for the Bitey Bride set. So that's at least two pieces down. And another legendary, it is the Chili Bean Pinata. That one's really cool for the pea shooter reaction legendary hat. I wanna showcase that one real soon. And a super rare for acorns everywhere. I don't know how I feel about a super rare expression, but hey, it is what it is. One last thing we have to unlock, the kitty hand bow, part of the pretty kitty set again. Good to see that. And a rare. Doctor Nurse Vision, Doctor Nurse set, so that's two pieces in with the Doctor Nurse. Okay, like 800,000 coins remaining. We got Agent Vision, Agent Overkill set. This is a bit worrisome, we're getting closer and closer to being zeroed out on coins, and I do not have Organism Overload. Oh, that's cool, I like that one. Um, but I do not have the Z Chomper. Oh boy. Nerdy leaf over, nerdy but nice set. I think I, I remember that, so we must have at least one piece in that. Oh, panda orange, a futuristic bounty hunter dressed as a panda. Nice, that was really cool, I like that one, it was very cute. Uh, Bitey lashes, part of the Bitey Bride set. We're almost done with the Bitey Bride set then. I'm not, I haven't really completed too many item sets. Egyptology basket, part of the Egyptology set. I'm really liking the looks of that one, for sure. Okay, so now we have, I think after this, 19 remaining, Fruit Noggin. <laughs> that one's cute, at the least. So yeah, we have 19 capsules remaining that we can open up here. It's electric. We're getting closer and closer. No Z Chomper just yet. I'm pretty sure Z Chomper is gonna be super rare. The Rump Shaker gesture for the engineer. Seems pretty cool to me. And the time to tour Taurus set. Oh, I think that's what that cactus has down here, right before you get into the Mangity Park area. Is it that set specifically? What about now? We get a common, the Night Mint, another recolor, very cool. It seems like a lot of them are either green or blue or pink. Those are the three main colors. This is occasionally an orange in there. Cyber Hazard Collar, part of the Citrus Cyber set. Nice, a little bit more progress with that one. A rare Swagger Point Jester for the 80s action hero. Not too much 80s action hero stuff today, so I'm glad to get a little bit more. The Merrymaker Teeth, part of the Merrymaker set. We got a little bit of that before. I'm guessing, yeah, that's the same set as the Chomper has in story mode that gives you the uh, bounty chest challenges. So, yeah. Glad that I'm recognizing these. Uh, nice with spice, nice and spicy set. I, I need to get a better look at that one to evaluate opinions on it, I think. There's only a tiny piece of it. Ducky Overboard, part of the Overboard set for Captain Deadbeard. That one seems new to me. So we are now down to, oh, a legendary! 
It is the Bagel Halo reaction hat. So what is that, our fifth legendary hat today? We have not gotten any legendary costumes, just legendary hats. Still a pretty cool one. Explorium Helm, part of the Funporium Explorium set. That's for the Space Cadet, that's what I'm looking for. So we have less than 10 remaining, and still no Z Chopper Friendship Forger for the Space Cadet, it's a gesture. It's a rare. Happy Tappy Jester for the Acorn. Target Goggles for the Pop Top Aviator set. Yeah, that's the guy who gives uh, bounty hunts in plant story mode. A super rare, come on! Natur Nature's Delight, <laughs> a Spectrum hat for Nightcap. This is all awesome stuff. I just really, really want Z Chomper. Taurus Topper, part of the Taurus set. Awesome. Oh man. Oh, it's super rare, come on! Commander S for the scientist. That's a really w nice one. I almost said it, I almost said cool. Oh no, I did. Two more remaining. What are the chances we can get Zebra Chomper? Come on, come on. That's a rare. It is the potted prote protection spectrum hat for the acorn. And then finally, the moment of truth after spending over three Million coins. Can we get the zebra chomper on the hundredth episode? Come on! Come on! Ah, it's the donut tipping victory slab. So not the best luck this time. That's okay. If I need to, next time we'll do a spending spree with four million coins and we'll get it that time, right? That was still a lot of fun. I want to dedicate the rest of today's episode going through everything, seeing the new stuff we have gotten because we should have new things for just about everybody. First off, for the pea shooter, we have the Azor P, which is basically just a blue recoloring of him. Brings me back to the, uh, what was his name? The Plasma P, right? I think from Garden War for one and two. Very nice looking. Um, and then other item sets and stuff. We have the legendary Chili Bean Pinata reaction hat. I want to showcase that one very soon. And then down this way, we have the Pegyptology basket, part of the Pegyptology set, three out of four. So we're almost done with that one. And same deal here, here's another, that's Precious Lay, two out of four for the Precious Floral set. Um, and down here, three out of four, once again, for the Pegyptology. Really wanna check that one out once we complete it. I didn't mean to do that, whoops. But for the Chomper now, what do we have for him? We should have a new costume, it is the Olive Chomper. Or do we equip it, looks like that. And then over this way, we have a number of items. Some of these I've already seen. Uh, but this one, the slug sub? I don't know, I don't think we got that today. I think we got that uh, for food fight. And oh, this is, yeah, we actually did complete the, the Bitey Lashes set. So that's the Bitey Lashes, or whatever it's called, the Bitey Bride. And this is part of the uh, Merrymaker set. We got two out of four for that. But here is the uh, Bitey Bow. We're equipped all known set pieces, there we go. Look at that. So that's one set we've gotten completed that we'll check out soon. Um, and we also have the Captain, the, the Crab Cake Plank Mouth. The Crab Cake, yeah, Captain Crab Cake set. That's a tongue twister. We got that a little while ago, I think. Um, very interesting, that's everything we have for Chomper at the moment. Well, it says there's more. Oh, there's more upgrades, okay. Um, for Colonel Corn, we got this right at the beginning. Corn Brotherhood is a costume. Yeah, he's uh, in, by the music piano area. I like him, he's cool, he's very moody. On top of that, we have what going on down this way? Oh yeah, we got the Jacko Cobb Spectrum hat, as you can see, has some different colors to it. I mean, none of them really beat orange, because it's just it's what a pumpkin's supposed to look like. Uh, the yellow looks fine, though, if you wanted a slightly different color. The blue and the pink look a little weird, and this isn't even purple. Huh, that's weird. I mean, this is supposed to be black. Very interesting. Anyways, there's that hat, and then down this way we have the Conquering Cobbs Corn Conqueror set. Two out of four pieces for this one, so we'll keep working on that. For the Nightcap, I know, of course, we have a new costume, the Night Mint. Night Mint has bad breath, that's funny. All right, um, and then down this way, we got the legendary Sudsy Squidzy Reaction Hat. That is sort of gross. I mean, I guess there's supposed to be like noodles and stuff with like the squid just chilling out inside the bowl. Is he alive? I hope he's okay. We also got this Nature's Delight Spectrum hat with the colors here a lot more vibrant. I do like that one. And then down this way, we've already seen those things. And then we got two out of three pieces for the Glam Cap set. We're getting there. 
I think this might be more of it. Yep, glam cap right there. And this is actually part of the Crystal Crusader set, two out of four. So we're making progress with some of these. Uh, when it comes to the hats, the Speedway cap. I think I might have gotten this a while ago. I do not recognize this, but it looks really cool. Nice helmet, Spectrum cap. We also got the Happy Burger. I'm pretty sure that was a part of Food Fight. Is that everything? That is everything. Uh, over this way, Target goggles, part of the Pop Top Aviator set, three out of four. And I think same thing, that this is a nice and spicy set, two out of four, and three out of four for that. Yeah, okay, Jovial Jester, one out of four. So that was our first part of the Jovial Jester set. No, wait, I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. But yeah, we're just going through everything, just trying to check out all the cool stuff we got, because we got a lot of cool stuff. Oh my gosh, what's wrong with me? Try that again. Okay, yeah, just the upgrades is trying to tell me about. We also got the Blush Cactus, which is very similar to the uh, Blush Sunflower, which we've already showcased. I love this one. This one I definitely want to show off soon. Um, on top of that, what do we have here? I don't think that's new. These definitely aren't new. This is, the tour set three out of four pieces for that. If I equip all known pieces, it's pretty close to getting there already, but not quite there. What else is going on? Uh, yeah, this was from Lawn of Doom. This we got a while ago. This we just got the fruit noggin. I like that one. Very, very cool, the fruit on her head. <laughs> and then down this way we have what? <laughs> this is funny looking. Um, the Taurus set again, three out of four pieces for all the watches and stuff. Cool. And for Citron, oh yeah, we got a whole set. So before today's episode, we didn't even have a single Citron costume. Now we have the Chocotron. Uh, we have the Panda Orange, and then finally the Sublime Lime. Out of the three, I'm not sure which one I like the most. I think it might be Panda Orange. It looks really cool. Um, on top of that, we got the legendary Bagel Halo hat, and these aren't new. This is the Nerdy Leaf Over, part of the uh, nerdy but nice set. Three out of four pieces for that one. Slowly getting there. Uh, the Citrus Cyber set is three out of four as well, and then down this way, Citrus Cyber set. We're getting there, we're getting there. Not quite completed though. Oh yeah, I don't know if I've ever showcased that I unlocked this. This is from uh, uh, Town Center. We'll showcase it eventually, the Pink Catastrophe. But there's a lot of hats here. The Gnomish Floaty, I've already shown. Queen of Fairies, same deal. But, what else? Oh yeah, the Pot of Protection and the Feathered Arrow Cap. Not bad, not bad at all. And then for Oak himself, we got part of the Beach Nut set, two out of four pieces, slowly getting there. Nothing new in terms of costumes for the Sunflower, but we'll just select the base for now. And then down this way, yeah, we got three out of four pieces for the Pretty Kitty set, getting very close for that. And over this way, same deal. We also, two out of four pieces for the Leaf Cadet. I did complete the Beach Nut set for Sunflower. Uh, that was part of uh, Town Center as well. And what do we got here? Pretty Kitty and Beach Nut again. We'll showcase that sooner or later. On top of that, this one I'm really excited for, the Fairy Queen Rose is absolutely gorgeous. This is amazing. I love the details in this one. The coloring is really cool. This one I'm excited to showcase soon. On top of that, we have the Majestic Crown, part of the Royal Rose set. Let me take a look at that, hold on. Let's turn Rose back to normal and this is a completed set right here, Royal Rose. I like that one a lot, very fancy, very royal indeed. Um, these hats are not new. Oh, I like how this one sits inside the little petals, that is so cute. Um, Fortune Cap is something we unlocked in today's episode. The colors for this one are very effective. Definitely do some variety of things with that. And also the Whip Top, which I'm pretty sure we did not get right now. I think that we got that in a previous episode. Here we have more Royal Fluff. So this might have been actually from story mode. This might have been from Town Center. We guess, I guess we didn't get too much for the rose. But that's all the plant stuff we unlocked. For the zombies, there's a whole new set of things, like over this way. Uh, yeah, we got the bomb squad for the soldier. This is part of story mode. I think the same deal over this way. We got the agent vision, which is two, one out of four. So we'll keep earning that up. For the imp, we got the Bug Beats Legendary Hat, which looks pretty simple to me, but I'm sure has a pretty wild effect to it. Um, and then these two. Okay, and then for the mech, we saw before, uh, the Fuzzy Fanatic set two out of four with that one, and the Astro Imp two out of three. So one more piece left to complete that one. 
for the super brains. We got ourselves what? Anything super exciting? Yeah, okay. The uh, hair flare mastermind, which we're getting there. We need one more piece somewhere, somehow. That'll be cool. Can't wait to get that and then the mus mustache for it right here. That seems cool. I, I know I said the word cool again. Uh, there we go, nothing new there. Oh yeah, part of this, uh, the mighty mistake. Oh, that's completed. Mighty mistake set right there. Oh, I remember him from the zombie town center. Very nice. And then this is groovy shoe, groovy smooth set. This is the only piece we have of that. All right. What about here? Same deal. Well, this is the rainbow bling set, which we don't quite have all of them. We have three out of four. Okay, we got more completed with uh, electric, or not electric, 80s action hero completed there than I thought. Does he have any other customizations? He doesn't, but for the electric slide, what new things does she have? She has this, this is the Disco Destruction Spectrum hat, which it changes the color of both the lights and the bandana. Oh, I like it, it's like a destroyed disco ball. Okay, very nice, we'll have to mix with that a little bit more later on. And then there's this way, Mr. Malo again. And then two out of four pieces for the Destination Punk set, we'll get there. Captain Deadbeard, I thought we got a legendary hat for him. Yep, we did, the crow's nest. Look at him up there, he looks so cool. He also looks very confused. <laughs> um, And then on this way, Ducky Overboard, part of the Overboard set. Three out of four pieces for that one, slowly getting there. Also part of the Overboard set, and also part of the Overboard set. So one more piece, probably for his beard. We'll get there. Uh, for right now, we set things. And for the All-Star, we got this. This was part of the story mode. Um, but where else? Yeah, we got these two pieces. This is one out of four for Golf Gully, one out of four for Kendo Doomjaw. Really not too much progress there. And two out of four for Mr. Bikes. Cool, I, I know. <laughs> Um, and then this I was really happy about. We got the costume for the Space Cadet. This is the Space Racer. It is very red. I like that. And on top of that, we have anything new here. This is the Space Chopper set. Three out of four pieces for that one. So we're getting there. And three out of three pieces for the Funporium set. Whoa, yeah, I like that. Okay, it's like a little arcade thing. Is that normally there? Like that? I don't think so. Hmm, that's nice, glad to have it. Yeah, it's like a little arcade board kind of thing. Definitely have to showcase that item set at some point. Also going here for the scientist, we got the Commander S super rare costume. And there was another one, wasn't there? Well, we got closer to a, like a set completed. We got the bookworm spectrum hat, which changes the color of this very chunky bookworm. I like it when he's, I think purple looks pretty cool. Orange looks the best though. I mean, I guess pink looks the most natural. Okay. And this is Organism Overload, two out of four pieces for that one. And four out of four pieces for the Dr. Nurse set. <laughs> looks very angry. I do like that though. So if we just do that and then go back to that, where was it? Uh, right here. That's the Dr. Nurse set right there. We'll definitely have to showcase that one soon. And this is another piece of it. And there should be the magnet Magnetic Magnificent set, one out of four pieces. Okay, so that means we only have one more character left to check out while we unlock for him. Uh, only one thing? No, okay. Oh wow, so we didn't lock a, a single thing for the engineer, except for maybe a gesture. I think we unlocked a gesture or two for him. But no customizations for him in today's episode, that's sort of a shame, but at least he got the rump shaker. You know, that makes up for all of it. He's got the rump shaker. All right, with that being said, let me know what cool things you got. Have you gotten the Z Chopper yet? Go ahead and make me jealous. <laughs> Stay tuned to next episode, because we are going to get started with the brand new holiday event. It will be Feast of Us. We'll be earning up all of the prize bulbs, getting those cool rewards, showcasing them. It'll be a bunch of fun. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment Zebra Spending so you've watched the end if you're a Zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.